Like, exactly. Are they good outside of Japan? This is what we're here to find out. And everybody travels to EVO to learn where they rank amongst the greats. Absolutely. I know we, we know plenty of local monsters ah, sorry, who yeah, come yeah. out yeah, and just get they're bodied. The be, they're the best in the basement. <laughs> All right. Starting off with Wolf Crone. Wolf Crone looks like he's playing. Yes. Wow. Oh, my goodness. I'm actually goodness. not sure what the Was he sandbagging those. for Evo? This might have been the best I've ever seen him play. And Hainiki dropping an opportunity there. Yeah. Okay. Ooh, nice. play reactions. Yeah. Uh-oh. Oh, it, wow, it didn't even need to go to Ultra. He knew that that would be enough to kill. Wolf Crow making a statement here against a Japanese player. We're not, still not sure how, how good he is yet, but yeah. he definitely is a solid player at the very okay. least. Wow. Oh, nice. That setup is, like, super dirty. Yeah. Very character-specific. Oh. Okay, good stuff from Wolf Chrome. Yeah, Playing great recognition of that neutral jump. Catching with the DP. Good answer from High Nikki. Really close to winning this. But all Crone really needs is one burn kick. Oh, oh and there's the wow. throw. This might be it. What's going to happen? Okay. Another throw. I like that. What? Right on top of his head. Yes. Oh. Very gutsy backdash. He's got to watch out for EX dash punches. There it is. You, you called it. What? Oh, wait. So was that a guess? Yeah. Correct me. That was a guess? No, that was a read. That was a read? That was a read. So I gave a read right now? You gave a read right On now. On stream? Yeah, yeah. Everybody heard it? Everybody yeah. at home heard Everybody me say heard what yep. was going to happen first? Yep, yep, yep. Okay, then. We oh. can continue commentating. We can continue commentating. What an amazing Mike. performance right now, Mike. And Wolf Crow <laughs> drops a big combo. That could have stunned. He's still in it, though. Oh, and there's wow. the stun. This is, this is ridiculous. Crone has been practicing. Oh, this, he's not letting this guy breathe. Why? Why would you let him breathe? Yeah. Oh, this is what he needs. Oh, yeah. wow. He messed up on the execution there. Hainiki cannot be happy. There's no such thing as a player that could be happy when you execute yeah. like that, you yeah. know? You know yeah, that was a he mistake. Is furious. Furious right now. All right. Let's see how he adjusts and adapts to the second game here. But again, back in that neutral Ooh. space. Yep. And Heineke's got in the corner a couple of times, but hasn't capitalized. Oh, and wow. again, another opportunity to capitalize with corner control and gets Ooh. popped in the face. Wow. Oh my goodness. What Wolf do you think Crone. the problem is for Heineke right the now? The problem is there's a few things. One, Wolf Crone is an incredibly talented player who has been off the grid for the past year. Hainiki, the, there's not that many Viper players in Japan anymore. That's you know, correct. A lot of them switched, either stopped playing or switched to a different characters. If you're not playing Dashio and uh, a bunch of the other guys, Kaibetsu, like, you just don't get that practice. Absolutely. Hainiki's got to make something happen here. All this right. Is, this is kind of the start of the end of what we saw that previous That's round. That's correct. And, and I think it's going to look a little bit more of the same. Yeah, let's see. All right, Crone. You, yeah. Oh. It's a good thing I didn't say that. You would have lost your mind. <laughs> I would have said, I hope he ultras his next dash punch. But now it's just over. A nice neutral jump to avoid that EX lunge punch. Oh, it's and over. We're at chip situation. It's yeah, over. Wolf Crone's got this under control. Dive kick, EX dash punch? Oh, he just did it. No, react to the EX lunge yeah. with your own EX. Okay. No, no, no. No need to avoid anything. Just yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, approach okay. it. Yeah, just play it safe. Play it smart. Well done from Wolf Crone. Convincing, convincing performance. Already defeating uh, one of the many Japanese players yeah. that, are, that are here. And I, and I feel as though the, the Japanese player, Hainiki, yeah. He, he got the corner control. He got to the corner several times. Yes. But as soon as he got there, he mm -hmm. never controlled it, right? Exactly. It, that and that's an issue sometimes. You, you when you get positioning and that's supposed to be in your favor, the next step, which is the most important step, is to convert yes. and keep him there for as long as you can. And we didn't see that happen at all. Not at all. 
So very unfortunate. For exactly. Him. But I'll tell you this much, man. Now I'm actually a little hyped and excited to see what Wolf Crone does in the rest of this tournament. Speaking of, you were mentioning earlier about Japanese players and mm -hmm. them being killers. Yeah. I don't know if you saw it, but early at like 8 in the morning, Long Island Joe. I saw it, that. Yes. Oh, my goodness. I got word that he played against the same Japanese Seth player, Gonzalez, I believe, and uh, mm -hmm. beat him again in losers. Yeah. But Ricky Ortiz put Long Island, uh, yep. put L.I. Joe into I actually losers. passed by, and I saw L.I. Joe playing Ricky, so I watched that match. Ricky was playing Rose. Oh, Rose versus guy. So, I see it. So some some little inside scoops, you know, yes. like he wasn't pl uh, uh, Ricky wasn't playing mm -hmm. Rufus or Poison was playing Rose. So right. she's got a backup character. Oh, and ladies and gentlemen, we have a special special treat for you on stream right now with being blessed by the presence of Mr. Shin Cheng over there in the white t-shirt, aka the Kobe Bryant of the FGC. Yeah. Um, Self-proclaimed Kobe Bryant of the FGC, mind you. Nobody Kobe. gave him that title but him.